about President Momodu Buhari and his service chiefs revealed there is trouble as a lawyer has revealed an unknown truth about Nigerian president and his chief services. You must be asking who the service chiefs are. Your question will certainly be answered here. The service chiefs include the current occupants of the offices of the chief of defense staff, chief of army staff, chief of navy staff and chief of air staff. You must be wondering what the hidden truth is. Keep reading to find out. A constitutional lawyer and partner at Manke Chambers and Associates, Barrister Dan Makolo, has petitioned President Momodu Buhari and others over alleged illegal stay of the service chiefs in office. What could be the possible reason and result of this petition? The lawyer claims that the above-mentioned service chiefs have, have overstayed their welcome in service and should be retired. How will President Muhammad Buhari undo this truth? The service chiefs should have been retired long time ago, but he kept them in office for reasons best known to him. This lawyer does not seem to be giving up anytime soon as he is bold and hesitant on these claims. He added that it is illegal to keep them in office after their stipulated time of service ended. The constitutional lawyer is asking the president to retire his service chiefs immediately and cancel whatever actions has been taken by them after their legal years of service expired. Here is the most interesting part of it. The lawyer is also asking the president to refund all disbursements inclusive of extra allowances and salaries received from federal service accounts. Do you think this petition will be looked into or is this even possible? The lawyer further stated that elong elongation of tenure will cause any future aspirants of those offices to be nonchalant about their duty. Do you agree with me on that? Furthermore, further information on this will be brought to you as soon as there is another update. Thank you viewers for listening to this news. Hmm. It's really disturbing that members of APC across the nation, old and young, do not know that Nigeria is dying. Good luck, Jonathan government may be corrupt, may be sluggish may be slow but security was okay then security was okay then why is this one worse why is this the moment of rise government why is it causing us pains why is it causing us headache why and i know reason why president Muhammadu buhari have refused to retire the ch service chiefs even when they are their tenor is over. The reason is he would still want to keep them because of the evil things they are doing in the cabals. They are doing in the government. He believes that if he changed um, the service chiefs, it will never be, they will never cooperate with him like the former service chief. That is what he's afraid of. He's also afraid of being overthrown by anybody. I know that all their hidden agenda will be made known by a new chief, a new uh, service chief. This is why he has refused to let go of this present of this of the uh, the, the uh, former service chiefs. 
This is what we all know. We don't know much about what is going on in various governments. We know few of them, but this one is very, very, very essential. It's very essential. Yes, we thank um, Man 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 Mangolo. We thank him, thank him so much for all this, for exposing these people, for exposing President Modu Buhari. President Modu Buhari thought he is smart, but and he is not smart. He is not. With what with what this man has said now. I'm very much sure that if Buhari realizes or realizes that Nigerians are now aware of his eating agenda, then it will make sure that things thing make sure that it dismiss this chief of staff because the rest of people that have refused to support the Mumu Buhari in villa in the villa would definitely expose him. So he would not have any choice than to let them go and reappoint another chief of staff. Oh, sorry, service chiefs, whatever you call it. Yes, considering the caption of this writer, it's, it's, it's a nice one. He has made us to know what Buhari is up to. Yes, I know that Buhari is keeping these service chiefs, is keeping them to ensure um, the implementation of the ethnically proposed Ruga program. No more, no less. This is why he's still keeping them. He's keeping them because they are all Fulanese. He's afraid that nobody, the new service chiefs, will not cooperate with him. Will not cooperate with him. If he, he will cooperate with him like the former service chief. So that is what Buhari is afraid of. But these former, former service chiefs are always supporting President Modi Buhari in his evil and um, um, evil and greedy character attitude of his. They all loot Nigerian money, all the money that were uh, that they sent in um, supporting those that have COVID-19 from millionaires, from billionaires, from companies, and so on and so forth. They are eaten by these so-called service chiefs and their leader, President Momodou Buhari. He is controlled by the cabals in the north. If he dares retire them, the truth about the presidency will be revealed. This is what he is afraid of. Yes, let him go to court if that is all the secret you have revealed. Let him go to God. God will give you the ray, the grace. God will give Pestemodi Buhari the grace, the grace, sorry, to remove them. That is the tribalism and nepo nepotism. We South South are pointing at. The president will retain his nonsense. They will ret you to retain his nonsense that are overdue. For retirement while retires and delays the south south that are due for promotion and appointments why can't president modi buhari choose a uh, um, uh, uh, southeast instead of northern lands being under him because he believes that the fulanese if he employs the fulanese they will understand each other's language than other tribe, but well, this is not good. It should try the southeast and the south south as well. It shouldn't be biased. 
it shouldn't be biased. According to what people have been saying, that there's no Buhari. The Buhari they, they, we know can't tolerate this lousy and non informing military. So let's all forget about uh, sacking them because he will never do that. Jibri will never do that. Yes, he will never do such a thing because of the um, uh, evil intention evil ambition he has always dreamt of and opportunity has come for that so viewers your comment is needed don't hesitate to drop them below the comment box click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to receive updates whenever i publish new videos thank you